It was a group working on deep sea mussels and clams, and they were going along down in a canyon around 3,000 meters, and they basically stumbled across this carcass of a whale. They noticed this weird kind of red fluffy plumes growing over the bone and brought some up, and at that point they didn't even really know what kind of animal it was. Um, they then sent it to Greg Rouse, and uh, he realized that it was a polychaete worm, but there are a few really, really strange things about it. All of these worms were female, for starters. Um, no males anywhere. And only after a lot of examination where they basically found that there were some small, tiny, tiny little males living in the tube with the female. So the worm actually lives in a, like a transparent tube. The thing, it wasn't just a single male associated with a female. They could have groups, groups of males, up to 100 or so, or sometimes just a few, but could be lots and lots. So it's maybe a nice thing, you have 100 males in your house. <laughs>